What's going on, beautiful people? Machiavelli Mills TV and y'all. Yesterday's price is not today's price. That is what Mr. Shaheen Holloway is going to be screaming tonight after his St. Peter's Peacocks defeated the Purdue Boilermakers by a score of 67 to 64. And I'm watching this game, y'all. This game was absolutely amazing. Without question, y'all. St. Peter's becomes the first 15 seed team to advance to the Elite Eight. And rightfully so. Deservingly so. This team is nothing short of poised, disciplined, hungry, physical, and fearless. And that would describe their head coach, Shaheen Holloway. Shaheen's so hot right now, he's the hottest coach in America. He can get whatever job he want right now. And I don't think, if you told me he can't, I think you're lying. I think he can get the New York Knicks head coaching job right now. That's how hot Shaheen is right now. Seriously. The way his team is disciplined, the way they listen, the way that their offense runs, like every, it's so much movement in his offense, nothing but it's a whole bunch of backdoor cuts, slicing, cutting to the basket, cutting to the rim. That's why they're beating these big teams, these big name teams. They're getting them up out of there. And Shaheen's confidence, how confident he is. Like this team has taken on the persona of their head coach, which is marvelous to watch. Shaheen is a, is a nothing but a confident kid from New York City, right? Played at Seton Hall. You know, and that aura, that New York swagger, that, that new, excuse me, the New Jersey swagger and all of that mix is rubbing off into the team. Now, a lot of the teams, a lot of his players are from New York City or Jersey, so they already got it in them. But even the ones that's not, the whole, the whole team is rubbing off on the whole team, and it's boding well for them. I'm rooting for these guys all the way through and through, man. You know, like I, I, I always say this, I root for my Chicago kids and my Morgan Park alum, uh, fellow Morgan Park alum, Charlie Moore is about to play against um, Iowa State. He plays for, he's the point guard for the Miami Hurricanes, right? But if it ain't Miami, I'm rooting for St. Peter's, man. What a magnificent job by Shaheen. Seriously, defensively, this team is sound. Like, Purdue won on two five-minute five droughts. Two five-minute droughts in this game because they was denying them boys, man. And to have them big old dude, like 7'4", to do to the hell in their squad, for them to still maintain that, like five minute drops and all of that, that speaks volumes about not only the coaching, but the dudes that they got on that roster, man. Just simply like them dudes dogs. And I'm watching this team play. They don't play like a regular, ordinary Cinderella. It's not fluky shots all the way through and through, just fluky shots just getting thrown up and they just happen to fall in. Them boys hooping. They going out there and hooping and saying, what's up? What's happening, right? And that's why you see at the end of the game, you see uh, Shaheen Holloway say, what they going to say now? What they going to say now? And if anybody has ever seen Through, uh, through the Wire, the Sebastian Telfair documentary that documented his rise from high school and going straight to the NBA being a lottery pick, uh, Sebastian Telfair's late brother, Daniel Turner, he said that after, um, I think after Bassey, uh, yeah, when I think this when Bassey got the uh, Adidas deal or whatever, they said, he said, what they going to say now? What they going to say now? They saying get tiny, saying get his head coach and all that. What they going to say now? We winning, we shining, and we got a millionaire dude right here, man. And Shaheen saying what they going to say now, right? They thought we was a fluke. They thought it was just something. We thought it, they thought they were a flash in the pan. No, man. This ain't this ain't for play. Them boys going out there against top teams, uh, playing confidently, and getting them dudes up out of there. Seriously, man. Shaheen... You can fire, you can fire uh, Tom, Thibodeau, Tom Thibodeau right now and hire Shaheen. You can fire Frank Vogel right now and hire Shaheen over there. Braun will sign off on that. Bring Shaheen over there, man. And Shaheen understands the game. It's so crazy. I never put together because I, I watch all the Smoke podcasts all the time. So I'm hearing Stack talk about, you know, all the, form, form, excuse me, the former players who was in that uh, 95, was it not yet? I think the 95 McDonald's All-American game. And he always brought up Shaheen Holloway. He, it was a name he always talked about. And everybody be like, oh, yeah, Shaheen. Shaheen was cold. He was cold. I didn't piece together like this is the Shaheen Holloway they talking about. The head coach for the St. Peter's Peacocks. They talking about him, man. And, look, and man, look, the, the magnificent job he's doing. Let me give a shout out to the players. Uh, Daryl Banks III, um, Doug with Eater or Eddard, uh, Clarence Rupert. Um, you know, you got guys that just putting, like, they got a whole team. Nobody is putting up. 30 and 40 and nothing crazy, but they all play well as a team. They're a, they're a, they are a well-oiled machine. And so when they get out there on their court, they don't give a damn who you are. They don't care if you Kentucky. They don't care if you Duke. They don't care if you Iowa. They don't care if you Purdue. They don't care if you um, 
um, any of the, the top teams, uh, they don't care. They don't give a damn about none of that. They want all smoke. They don't care if you Arkansas, whatever. They know that they they feel confident that they can play with anybody, especially after beating excuse me beating Kentucky. Basketball is a game of momentum, and when a team has momentum after defeating a big team, it carries over. Carries over confidence. Carries over as well, right? And, and man, it's, I, I love watching this team play, y'all. I'm excited. Every I'm, I'm ready to see them play the next round. I'm ready to see what they can do the next round, man, because, I, man, they just so well coached, and, and Shaheen's a likable guy. The team is a likable guy, man. What's the dude, Doug Eder, Eder the little, the mustache, the the, the school, um, the alums or the, the excuse me, the um, the students, the student section, they got the mustaches all on them and stuff like that and everything. They're excited, and for real. Shaheen, man, he, he either seen either, either his alumni, alumni, Either his alma mater, Seton Hall, is going to uh, back the Brinks truck up in his front yard, or an NBA team or somebody else going to do it, or one of these other Power 5 schools going to do it, because they recognize what they're seeing, man. It's for real. It's official. And um, I'm happy for that brother, man. I'm very, very happy for that brother. Um, Because he was nothing short of a baller. It was just he was a very small guard at the time, had an injury, so on and so forth. They derailed him. But you can see that. He knows the game by the way he coaches his players. You can see that. And, um, you know, talking about the defensive job that they did, man, Jaden Ivey. Jaden Ivey is a lottery pick. What, a top five pick people projecting as? He finished with nine points. And really that nine, he really had six for real. He had a little, a, a little three that he hoisted in the air at the end of the game. He wasn't on nothing. He wasn't on a crumb. And it's a, a, important to the defensive effort by, um, by St. Peter's, man. Got to get these boys credit. You got to get these dudes credit, man. Fun team to watch. Uh, hard nose. And um, just playing with a lot of swagger, fam. What they going to say now is what Shaheen Holloway saying. What's happening? What's going on? And, um, they, I, again, I'm excited. I'm ready to watch them play. I wish they played tomorrow. I'll, I would watch them all the time because the fearlessness that they have. And he described it, man. Like he said, I got dudes from New York City. I got dudes from uh, New Jersey on my team. You think we scared of physicality? We ain't scared of being physical? We do that, is what he said. We do that. And I said, the way he said it with confidence, I'm like, shout out to New York City, man. Shout out to Jersey. Because it sound like, just that sound, just like something a person from Chicago would say. We not scared of no physicality. We do that. What's happening? So I, I respected that, and I saluted that all the way through and through. Congrats to Shaheen and his program. The first 15 seed, 15 seed program to advance to the Elite Eight. That's a big deal, y'all. That's special. All the other Cinderella teams through the tournament, none of them was a 15 seed. Look what's happening. Look what's shaking, man. It's something past. That's a, that's a dope thing to watch, man. Machiavelli Mills TV, y'all. Y'all let me know what y'all think about the tournament overall and what y'all think about this St. Peter's basketball team. I'm out. Peace.